Thanks, Don. You know, I was actually dwelling a little bit on why we do the show, and you know, we talk about every week. It's it's not just your financial wellness; it's also your personal and financial wellness. That's right. And what we talked about a little while ago is not just the personal and financial wellness for an individual, but NAREP's committed to doing it for an entire community, for an entire group of people, for an entire demographic. And the fact that they're going to Washington and lobbying for this group and making sure that this group who bought 53% of the homes, that's just a crazy number, in the last quarter, uh, that's really powerful. That's really important. And that's why we have such a great great guests in, in in the studio with us today. And I don't, I don't want to fail to mention our beautiful young lady that's with us today, Maria Provenzalo. Oh, Provenzano. Robinsano. Gosh, I knew You thought I you would. nailed it. You thought no, you had it. No, I knew <laughs> I would hack it sooner or later. Sorry. Maria Provenzalo. Yeah. Close enough. All all right, we'll take all it. Right. It's all right. So if you want, if you want to uh, see Maria and, and the Don and Gino and Federico and Jesse, go to uh, our website at donandgino.com. That's D-O-N-A-N-D-G-I-N-O.com. It has all our web, our, our, basically all our shows on it. If you click on Listen Live, it has all our shows on it as well as our YouTube channel. And you can check out and find out more about us and our wonderful guests. And I want to find out more about one of our guests here first, uh, Federico Rabe, who is... Um, just a, a all-around good guy. He is not just involved in NAREP, but also he's an insurance and financial professional. I mean, he has a real professional life. He takes his time out to do NAREP, but on top of it, he's involved in, in so much more. He's got his wife, Costanza. Costanza, correct. Costanza. You said it so well. Yeah, thank you. Two beautiful daughters, Sofia and Valentina. Uh, he likes racing sailboats. Very cool. Now, what's funny, this guy has everything else that's on my resume as well. Soccer. I'm <laughs> playing tonight, believe it or not. There you go. That's right. I play Tuesday. I play tonight. Uh, well, I, I'm a pylon that shows up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how much I play because I play against you Latino folks that run around circles around me. And sometimes he comes up he's like, oh, I'm playing the Argentinian team tonight. We're going to get our butt kicked. Uh, and, we, <laughs> and, and honestly, we do. We do. They absolutely do circles around us. We're, we're team white boys, and we just run around <laughs> in circles. But it's good Pops actually. Pops of the rusty it's, bolts, though. It, it, that's <laughs> what our team is. <laughs> That's right. Uh, golf, racquetball. I play a lot of racquetball. Actually, it's sponsored by E-Force, believe it or not. There you go. Yeah, so bring it on, buddy. Next time. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> and, of course, snow, snowboarding. And he's, he's owner of Ra Rabe Insurance Rabe. Correct. Uh, with Farmers. And he's been in the industry, like I said, for 17 years. He can handle your insurance, 401K rollovers, uh, college funds, so much that you – and I know you did got into this for a reason, not just to make money. Correct. It ties in with your whole NAREP giving and helping people. And, and Well, um, when I got a call from my friend and founder of uh, the chapter in 2005, Karina uh, Blas de los Reyes, she, um, I'm an insurance guy. So when she called me and said, you know what, Federico, I want to be part of this association. We're going to found it. And I said, what can I do in insurance? And then I realized that uh, for the last couple of years, I've been seeing clients losing their houses at the same time losing, canceling the insurance. And I say, what can I do to help? So it looks like that call was perfect timing because I got there and in 2005 getting different position from director of membership, uh, uh, compliance, uh, vice president, now president. I'm, I'm able to give back to the community. I can help to be part, instead of telling my grandchildren, you know what, read a history book. I say, I was the history of farmers and, and NAREP. And NAREP is, uh, helping right now the communities and people losing houses we are educating people to make sure that that doesn't happen and we don't go back to what happened a couple of years ago uh, that's it. i love that you're here with us federico you you represent what we are so proud to represent which are great people in, in our industries and uh, both the financial and real estate communities and you represent that well so make sure you reach out to federico rabe dot com right correct that's f-e-d-e-r-i-c-o-r-a-b-e -E <laughs> All right, I had to close my eyes at the Ooh. first night. But yes, yeah, FedericoRabe.com, and you can reach out to such a good guy to help you out with your insurance and financial needs. Also, we have Jesse here with Pinnacle Estate Properties, and I was thinking a little bit about the story that you told us and how you helped someone who's so deserving of buying a home. And I think that's what makes you know agents different. What does differentiate one agent from another is how much conviction they have and how much motivation they have to actually go above and beyond for someone that needs to get into a home. You know, I don't know who that agent he was working with before was, but obviously didn't have the motivation and conviction to help him get a home. 
Correct. They did it. And, you know, I just, uh, you got to put the client first. And uh, what I always do in my transactions and helping people, the client is always first. I, I thought about a slogan for years, and I just got it trademarked, and it's serving people, selling properties. Hmm. Serving hmm. people always comes first before selling the property. And I think that's what consumers hmm. want. They want to somebody that's going to take care of them, that's going to guide them through the transaction and represent them well in uh, buying their house. Well, I think they want Jesse Perez. <laughs> There's no doubt about it because you, you can tell in both your convictions and your passion and what you do. And, again, that's why we are, we're very proud to have you both on the show because um, you guys are just dedicated to helping others, and, and whether it's in your business with – uh, you know, Farmers Insurance with Federico, or it's with Pinnacle Estate Properties and Jesse being a, a real estate professor for the last eight years, Rookie of the Year and Diamond Club. I mean, you you got passion, and and you love helping people. And, and kudos to you. Thank you. And uh, speaking of helping people, why don't you explain Jesse a little bit of why Federico was chosen to basically spearhead not rep out in Santa Clarita and San Fernando Valley? Sure. I met Federico, I think it was in 2007, 2008, and uh, he wasn't president of the chapter. He was, um, I forgot compliance what Compliance director. Compliance moment, yes. director, I believe it was. But even though he had that position, he always had the passion. He was always filling in the gaps. He was diligent. He spent a lot of time. He uh, picked up the slack on, you know, on, on other departments. And uh, so, you know, needless to say, he demonstrated leadership since way before. And when he became president this year, I mean, it was just a turnaround in the chapter. We're having great events. Um, you know, we're Great growth. Yeah, great growth, 70%. 70%, 70%. in 11 months. Yeah, yeah. amazing. So, yeah, I'm, I'm sitting next to this, this man. Yeah. <laughs> Very so it's nice. It's well, well deserved. I mean, he, he really sh uh, has, um, you know, the leadership skills and the passion, uh, the passion to, uh, to lead this organization. And uh, so we're glad to serve under him. I mean, we, we comprise of a board of directors of 10 people. And he's the president, and uh, he sets the tone for everybody. So he's he's leading the way, and uh, we're very very. You happy know what, to have Jesse? Uh, the admiration is mutual. Um, uh, because of my daughter, I have a three-year-old. As I told you earlier, Don, she had a red syndrome. Which, for you to understand what it is, is just put a imagine having cerebral palsy, epilepsy, and Parkinson all wrapped in one body. My uh, daughter is three years old. Valentina. We've been having, Valentina. We've been having challenging time, but thanks to God, everything's gonna be okay. And I'm going to have to not be able to do the second term. And so when I say, Jesse, Jesse, you're the perfect fit. I never met someone so professional, so business ethics. Thank you for being here. And I'm, I can live knowing that you're going to do a good job. Thank you, Jesse. Thank you, Federico. And if, if I may, may I mention our next upcoming event that we're having? Nice. Absolutely. Yeah, so basically as a non uh, chapter organization, we meet every Thursday of the month. But this month, we have our national conference going on. It's going to take place at the JW Marriott at LA Live. And that's going to start October 7th, which is Sunday through the 9th. And, um, you know, we, we're going to have some of the nation's largest short sale managers uh, there, servicers there, some politicians, the mayor of Los Angeles, a past president, uh, Freddie Mac, REO Asset Managers. So it's going to be a great event. And, and of that's course, gonna, Federico and Jesse. Yeah, Federico, we will, uh, Federico yes. will be there. I will be there <laughs> as well. And... Um, so we'll if you if you're interested in uh, in more information, you can go to our website. That's nareepsfsc.com, and you can register there and get more information. It's going to be a great event. That is going to be a great event, and I know that you guys are going to have a blast and keep helping people. And I really want to thank you for being with us today. Thank you, Jesse, and thank you, Federico, and thank you, Maria, for coming with us today. And you you didn't speak much today, but you dressed up our show, and we were glad to have you here. So it was absolutely fantastic. I love to hear about the growth and the direction for NAREP, and I'm excited to have you guys here. And you guys are a great partnership together, just like Gino and I with uh, Cherry Creek, and you guys with NAREP. We want to thank you very much for your time today. You you guys are awesome. The best show I've ever been and i ever listened. You guys are truly professionals. Thank uh, you now we know you're coming back. You're buttering <laughs> All right. We want you back every Thursday, 1 p.m., right here on AM 1220 KHDS for the Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance Show. Thank you for joining us. Joe Messina up next.